bring you. You are the greatest challenge of this tournament could bring me. Pathetic. Tiger! What is this feeling inside me? Ryu, since adopting you those many years ago, within the walls of my dojo I have watched you grow from a boy to a man. From an awkward novice to my greatest pupil. I have witnessed you master every form and technique. I have taught you as if you were the one who created them. I have seen you find what so many seek but fail to achieve. The delicate balance between grace, speed, and power. You stand on the brink of becoming everything I had hoped you would. Or possibly, everything I have feared. You have come far since you began your journey, driven by the same desire for perfection that I once saw in another many years ago. He too completely dedicated himself to mastering our Shotokan arts. But his journey took him down a vicious and brutal path. His quest to fulfill his fighting potential awoke in him a ruthless brutality. His training had taken him to a crossroads. To pursue greatness with honor and purity of heart, or to allow his desire for victory to become a murderous deed. When faced with his choice, he chose to sacrifice his humanity for the sake of power. These are the same crossroads that you will soon reach. And this, is the same decision that is still yours to make. There is a side of you that you must confront, as must all of us who choose to devote our lives to the pursuit of our arts. You must face the part of you that ruthlessly craves to win, even when the price is too high. When the price of that victory is taking human life, all of us who choose the way of the warrior must eventually do one thing. We must face ourselves and fight. You must fight and decide who you truly are. The battle may be difficult. Negativity, wrath, and cruelty often seem to overcome goodness, <gasps> peace, and honor. In the taunting face of your dark half, you cannot give up. Do you, my son and pupil? I hope you will fulfill your limitless potential. Not by succumbing to your power, but by mastering it. Every light must have its darkness. But do not let yours defeat you. Ryu! Dream? That cry, it was Master Gaukins. But no, it couldn't be.
Ryu, why are you doing this? Master Gaokin was my teacher too. He was like my father. You don't know what I'm feeling. No one does. Don't you? No! What have I done? Ken! He's not here. He's with Eliza. I was dreaming. What's happening to me? Am I losing my mind? Do you feel that, Gauken? Ryu possesses it. The same power you were too afraid to embrace. Even though you withheld the final teachings from him, you could not keep him from finding them within himself. You could not keep him from discovering his destiny, as I discovered mine. I think we have practiced enough katas for now, Ryu. You are ready to begin sparring and putting your theory into practice. Allow me, Gauken. I would love to see how far young Ryu has come along in his training. <laughs> Very well, Ryu. Take it easy on Retsu. He's not as young as he used to be. I won't disappoint you, Master. Come on, Ryu! Don't hold back! Yes, the Dark Hadu. You have tasted its power as I always suspected. Perhaps one day, you will be worthy to face me. If you wish to avenge Gao Ken, seek me out at the next Street Fighter tournament. Ugh. Embrace your power and prove to me that I have not spared your life in vain. What are you? Stand down, Ryu! Ritsu, are you hurt? I'm fine, Galkin. Your student is much stronger than he appears. The master, I don't know what came over me. I, I just didn't want to disappoint you. You have not, Ryu. I have always known that you possess the desire to better yourself, that all true martial artists do. That aspiration is what propels us to our greatest heights. But that same longing for perfection can also destroy us. I hoped that you would never experience it, but that is the power that you just felt. The same power that drove my brother mad. What can I do? Only this. No matter how much you desire victory, no matter how much that darkness inside you hungers for it, Never forsake your humanity for it. Can you promise me this? Yes, Master. I promise. you continue to resist, boy? Until my last breath. Why do you resist the power within? I don't desire power. 
I have my sights set higher than that. What is it you seek, then? Ah, but you have no answer. Seeking anything but power is foolishness of the highest order. The blood flowing through your veins calls out to you. Answer it. Answer it with your life. No! Then I shall murder you myself. This mundane world is of no concern to us. We grow stronger by consuming human life. Enough! <laughs> about my birth. My earliest memories are of Master Gotetsu and Master Gokin. I remember Akuma training with them. He was strong, stronger than the others. All he cared about was power. Then one day, he murdered Master Gokin. I must defeat Akuma. However, I can allow myself to become like him in the process. What can I do? All my blood and sweat and training brings me no closer to finding my true purpose. Keeping my urges under control takes all the power I can muster. I don't know how long I can resist. Ken! Must destroy everything! The power of absolute destruction! To kill! That is the only destiny of your fist! No. You're wrong. That can't be the only answer. So, you've awakened. Master. You were nearly consumed by the Satsui no Hado. I was... I take it you're Ryu, yes? Yes, and you? I am Rashid of the Turbulent Wind, a hero of the wind who travels the world. The oh, master. And why has a hero come here? Long story, I won't bore you with it. In any case, could I ask you for a favor? I would appreciate a match. I wish to test my mettle against you. Master. <laughs> But, why? The internet said, when you assume a fighting stance, he doesn't hesitate to fight back. Are you not feeling well? The answer lies in the heart of battle. Did you somehow forget? You say that all the time. But Master, it may eventually overwhelm. The heart of battle is not just to understand opponents, but yourself as well. If fear of yourself stays your feet, you won't find the answer. Of course, you don't need me to tell you that. Hey! <sighs> if you're not up to fighting today... Understood. I'll fight. Master. But this was helpful. I learned more about my skills. I'll get to go home with a great story. Thank you. I'm glad I was able to fight with you. Yeah, me too. See ya! You are leaving? Like him, I need to better understand this power. Hmm. Then I believe you should seek out Ken. He has been very worried about you lately. Yes. Sorry I'm late. Master told me about how you're doing, and about the Satsui no Hado. The Fist of Destruction. I must find an answer. Something that doesn't lead to it. <laughs> okay. I can help you with that. Come on, you! Yeah. Let's do it. That wasn't too shabby. But I... Don't worry about it. Even if you lost yourself to the Satsui no Hado, 
I'd be here to take you down and stop it. So relax already. Just go and fight. Right. No. The Satsui no Hado. It's consuming me! Coming with us. Bison has summoned you. What the? Yet I am not sated. More blood. 
More violence! This Hadi wants a fight to the death! Nothing less! Mistaking it, he has awakened. You've sealed off his power. How dare you! Raging demon! The power of nothingness. Interesting. Let this be a fight to the death. The winner claims the cub. なぜ力を恐れ、なぜ意の<笑>
still haven't transcended humanity, huh? You lack discipline. You haven't transcended your humanity. You've thrown it away! <laughs> Prepare to meet your maker! It was a vicious fight indeed. Each man was prepared to give up the ghost in what was to be their ultimate battle. Now it is time for me to return to my own fight to the death. The only reason I still draw breath. Kuratsuha! <laughs> 